20 seconds in Thailand, Thailand are up. I just flew all the way over here to show you one of the most beautiful beaches in Thailand. It's one of the biggest beaches I've ever seen. Look at this. The only issue that you can have with that is I'm not in Thailand. You guys are so funny. I gave so many hints. A few of you got it. It was funny because the other day I tweeted that I was on a 777, which is one of the biggest planes on earth. And then uh, the other day on, um, on Instagram, I actually snapped a photo of a restaurant in Sarasota, Florida. I'm here where I used to live 10 years before Thailand on one of the most beautiful beaches in America. Look at this white sand. And it's so quiet here today. This is good. Just look how big the beach is. Because someone asked me just yesterday in a comment, they said, do you like American beaches better or Thailand beaches? And I had a real quick answer. The beach, like for the beach, the actual sand on the beach, and being clean, America, we have a clean, nice, pristine beach here. But the view, seriously, the view is beautiful, but this has got nothing on Thailand. I'm gonna try to come back here and show you the sunset because right now it's the morning and this place, this is the beautiful sunset in the evening. So I'm gonna try to get back and show you that. All right, let's go have some fun. Yeah, it's my semi-annual trip back to America. I only come back here twice a year. I try to do it during the holidays and this time I get to uh, hang out on the 4th of July, which I missed completely last year. You guys know me and my hamburgers and hot dogs. I guess they're working on the palm trees here. I don't know what's going on there. It's so out of season here, man. There's not even any traffic. Look, this is awesome. Because usually it's a nightmare to drive down here. Yeah, but you guys in the comments, it was funny to, um, to read the comments like I was trying to be sneaky and not let people know. Where am I? Oh, I gotta turn here. And not let people know where I'm at. I just like surprises. Yeah, it was just funny that you guys thought I was trying to be all sneaky. I actually was kind of being a little sneaky. I just wanted to surprise everybody. I said that, yep, I've come back for my semi-annual to see my family, see my son. And uh, I'm actually house sitting a couple of puppy dogs, which is a, a whole nother thing. But wait till I show you this house. It's my friend's house, but they've remodeled it into a place that I would never want to leave. Anyway, now I gotta go find one of my crazy friends that works at a breakfast shop over here. Another broken egg cafe. Thank you. And these are our summer specials. Thank you. Yeah. Cat doesn't know I'm here yet, so when she sees me, she's gonna have a big, like, silly face. That's her in the purple. Got a fried green tomato BLT. Mm. Looks I'm good. So <laughs> Is it, what, the sandwiches available? Yeah. Uh, Anything you want. Yeah. Uh, the BLT sounds fine. The, the glass or the fried green tomato BLT? Okay. What's the other one? We got a fried green tomato hey. BLT. A fried green tomato BLT. I know he looks familiar. And what else do you have? He's going to choke you, baby. <laughs> I haven't seen him in over a year. Oh my God. Nice haircut. We have a blast, oh, thanks. Baby. That has the crispy bacon. We always and have the a avocado. blast. I know you do. Should I have the blast or should <laughs> I, I have the green tomato one? The fried green tomato BLT Which one? or the blast? Baby? Fried green tomato. Alright. She said fried green tomato, so yeah. <laughs> we'll be back. Look at these cool coffee cups. I think it's 
cool. Fried green tomato BLT and some fries or chips, depends on where you live. Mm. Very good. There's Boo. Hey, Boo. So yeah, no big super secret. I was trying to keep it a secret, but I couldn't help. There's the other one. It's Chips. Chips was asleep. Chips is kind of pissed off that it went outside. And this is my this is my friend's backyard with their pool. And I'm here dog sitting. Yeah, but it was time for another visa run, and I had to get out of the country anyway. And uh, so what happened was my friends said they were going on a holiday. Could I watch the dogs? My visa came up. It was time for me to go. I haven't been to the U.S. in six months, so I figured I'd do a semi-annual back to America, get my visa all straightened out. I'm gonna try to redo a visa in a different way so I don't have to do the same tourist visa run stuff. I'll let you know how that works out because you guys really love the questions about the visas. You sure do. But, yeah, kind of an overcast day today, but anyway, thank you guys for watching. I will, um, I will talk to you later. I hope you hang out with me. I'm sorry that I uh, didn't let everybody know that I was going to the U.S., but I wanted to surprise. I tried to surprise everybody that was over here, and that turned into a colossal, colossal train wreck. Because when I got here, things didn't work out. I was not able to get my rental car. I was not able to get a hotel where I was supposed to go, and I was walking around with bags, and nobody knew I was here because I was trying to keep it a secret, which messed everything up. But anyway, thumbs up, and I'll talk to you guys very, very soon. Maybe if the wind would stop blowing. That's the only thing about Florida is all the wind. Oh, well, it is a beach, so. But, uh, yeah. Maybe I can start doing little quicker videos and just uh, hang out by the pool. Can you take this asshole back to America, please? They did. Oh, shh. Not goody goody.